Makeup tips for men. How to cover a blemish. Hello and welcome to Video Jug. I'm Jo Reed, makeup artist at Blush, and this is my model here, Jack. Today I'm going to show you how to cover a blemish using concealers. The first important thing to look at is the tone of your skin. Do you have a pink skin or a yellow based skin tone? And there's one quite easy way of finding out which one you are. If you tan fairly easily, you're generally going to have a yellow skin tone. If you find that you burn really quickly in the sun, you've generally got a pink skin tone. And you want to find a concealer that contains either pink or yellow, respectively. Now, Jack has got a yellow skin tone, so I'm going to use a yellow-based concealer. And before you actually apply it to the area that needs to be concealed, just try it on the corner of your face and make sure that it blends in really easily with very little effort. If you can still see it, then you've got a concealer that's either too light or too dark for you. With a concealer for blemishes, you want to make sure that it's one shade lighter rather than one shade darker, because the area that we're concealing tends to be darker anyway. Now, Jack's got great skin, but I do see a tiny little mark here that we're just going to cover up. Using a brush, and this is a very fine brush, not a thick brush, very fine, round-headed brush, you apply it to the area and then just pat it in until it disappears. Now that's completely gone. You can actually take this around the nose as well. We all have redness around the nose. So just take this brush right into the corner of the nose and then just pat it in. This is a cream concealer. It's actually got quite a pasty consistency and this will last a lot longer than any liquid products that you might use. And really make sure that you do blend this. You don't want to see a load of concealer around the nose. It's a really big giveaway that you're wearing makeup. And just to finish this off, you can apply some translucent powder. This isn't actually necessary with this product, but if it gives you peace of mind, just apply some translucent powder over the top the concealer to set it and keep it in place. Great. 